Hello, I am Stephanie de Bats. I am a member of the Daikin Euro Product Development Group. I'd like to introduce you the heat pump convector. This heat emitter is designed for use at water temperatures of 35 degrees Celsius and it's a perfect match with the Daikin Alterma low temperature heat pump. The heat pump convector is here in operation at our Daikin Energy Saving House. A standard solution for heating a single family house is underfloor heating for the ground floor and radiators at the first floor. In the Daikin Energy Saving House we apply this typical solution but we have replaced the radiators on the first floor by heat pump convectors. Combination of underfloor heating with radiators requests two different water temperatures in the system. While underfloor heating operates at 35 degrees Celsius, radiators operate at a water temperature of at least 45 degrees Celsius to have sufficient capacity. These flow temperatures are the key to the heat pump's efficiency. This graph shows the heat pump COP varying in function of the water flow temperature. The conclusion is very clear. The lower the flow temperature, the higher the efficiency of the heat pump. A decrease of the water temperature from 45 degrees Celsius to 35 degrees Celsius can result in an increase of the seasonal COP between 20% and 40%. Now let us go back to the combination of underfloor heating with radiators. If the radiators can work at 35 degrees Celsius, the same temperature as the underfloor heating, the heat pump temperature can be set on 35 degrees Celsius instead of 45 degrees Celsius. And this results in an efficiency increase up to 40% and an equal decrease in your monthly electricity bill. And there's more. Combining underfloor heating with radiators divides your house into two zones. An underfloor heating zone at 35 degrees Celsius and a radiator zone at 45 degrees Celsius. To reduce the high water temperature to the 35 degrees Celsius at which the floor heating system is designed, a two-zone kit is necessary. And if this kit, including two pumps, can be omitted, it makes your installation even more energy efficient. It also decreases the cost of your installation. A simple solution would be to operate the radiators at 35 degrees Celsius. But this is practically impossible. The capacity of a radiator becomes very small at 35 degrees Celsius. A radiator operating at 35 degrees Celsius will have approximately 40% of its capacity at 45 degrees Celsius. If you want the same capacity at 35 degrees Celsius, you could oversize the radiator, but it will become two to three times as big. It's clear, the dimensions of a radiator become too big at low flow temperatures. The solution to all these issues is a heating element with an adequate capacity at 35 degrees Celsius and acceptable dimensions, the heat pump convector. At 35 degrees Celsius, the heat pump convector still has a capacity of 800 watt for the 15 class or 1000 watt for the 20 class, which are adequate capacities to heat up your bedrooms. Your house is heated completely at 35 degrees Celsius. The ground floor with underfloor heating and the first floor with heat pump convectors. And this way, the two zone kit becomes unnecessary. Setting your heat pump at 35 degrees Celsius can result, depending on the climate, in seasonal COPs above 3.5. The savings in running costs can go up to 40%. It's a perfect match with a Daikin Alterma heat pump. As you can see, the heat pump convector is a compact solution. It's about two and a half times smaller than a radiator with the same heating capacity when its feed temperature is 35 degrees Celsius. The heat pump convector has a fan inside that operates at low rotation speeds. This results in a very quiet operation. The sound pressure level of the 15 class at medium fan speed has a maximum of 19 dBA that's almost below hearing level. On top of that, the low rotation speeds avoid air draft, 
We have done measurements, both in the Daikin test rooms and in this house. At several locations near the unit, from 50 cm to 1 meter in front and above the unit, the air velocity has been measured. The airflow stays below 0.15 meters per second, which meets the criteria set forward in the European standard. The heat pump convector has extended control possibilities. Most central heating systems only have one room thermostat in the living room. If the living room is heated to the required set point, the boiler will stop. At that time, you cannot heat up other rooms, for example your bedrooms. With the heat pump convector, each installed heat pump convector can start up the heat pump and heat up the desired room to the required comfort temperature, independent of other rooms. You can even program a weekly schedule timer with several actions per day or control the fan speed. The heat pump convector is a heat emitter which gives the same comfort as a radiator in heating operation, but on top of that it has the possibility to provide cooling as well. Both full cooling at low water temperatures down to 7 degrees Celsius and drain free cooling at higher water temperatures is possible. A heat pump convector is the perfect match with the Daikin Alterma heat pump. It's small, quiet and has sufficient capacity at 35 degrees Celsius. The high seasonal COP results in considerable annual savings. The heat pump convector is the first heating element truly designed to operate efficiently at low temperatures. Both winter and summer it makes your home comfortable.